will be available later this week. All right, let's get over to First Alert Meteorologist Dave Aguilera right now with a look at our forecast and a beautiful shot of the sky. Uh-huh. Happy Wednesday, everybody. Things are looking good out there. Yeah, yeah sunrise is uh, just a few moments away. 638 official sunrise, but we're already starting to get a little light. A few wispy cirrus clouds out there really making it pretty this morning. 49 in Fort Collins right now. We have 40 in Evergreen, 50 in Castle Rock, Parker, and Centennial this morning. A little chill in the air out there. Big Phil Curry, East Franktown, is uh, one of our weather watchers out there. He has 45 degrees there in Douglas County. All right, on the satellite, a few of the clouds showing up here. There's more moisture out west. Look at this. A few showers and thunderstorms south of Grand Junction moving into Montrose here, and we'll tap into that this afternoon. We might get a few isolated thunderstorms around here, but the bigger thing is a cold front that'll be sliding through tomorrow and dramatically changing our weather for Thursday and Friday to finish out the week. Here's how it plays out for today. Clouds pushing. You can see you can see right out of the west. It's called zonal flow time zone to time zone right out of the west here. We've got moisture coming in scattered thunderstorms in the mountains by afternoon could see some showers and thunderstorms right along the front range, mainly on the west side. But one or two of those could go into Denver uh, DIA up into the Greeley areas all the way up to Fort Collins. So we've got a chance of thunderstorms today. Then tomorrow morning cold front in Steamboat and Meeker will be ahead of it in the morning and then after the noon hour the front slides through showers and thunderstorms in the afternoon and they really pick up late afternoon into the early evening tomorrow. Heavy showers and thunderstorms possible here. Maybe even some high mountain snow where again with this front uh, coming through and it will continue into Friday morning. Today though we're going to start out with some warm temperatures here. We are looking at 77 in Lone Tree, 75 in the Pinery down there in Douglas County, up north in Boulder County, 77 for Lions, Gun Barrel, Niwan and Hygiene all at 78 degrees this afternoon. Afternoon. So upper 70s to near 80 for the Denver metro area going on. If you're in western Colorado, 70s and 80s there, 60s and 70s in the mountains. And you can see 70s are a popular number here across the east. Now tomorrow, 68 degrees for the high. That is it with the system coming through. Here's a look now at the afternoon. Showers and thunderstorms for the afternoon commute. Then most of the night, 10 o'clock tomorrow night, good rains across the Denver metro area. Keeps on going until 5 o'clock in the morning Friday and then tapers off by the noon hour into to the afternoon 70 on Friday and then 79 on Saturday looking good for the Rocky Mountain Showdown. It's a night game, so it'll be in the 60s and 50s. And then for Bronco Sunday, we will win in the temperature department. <laughs> 84 degrees with sunny skies coming your so way. So declarative. Can wow. we win in the football department? <laughs> yeah, <what are> <laughs> nice, right? Uh, I don't know about that. Here's hoping. <laughs> well, we know one Colorado football team will win this weekend, that right? That is true. There's, There's that. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, right. Somebody yeah. will. All right, let's uh, get a check.